All right, you guys love this one, so I'll do it again. We got the Joker. Watch as it changes, just like so. And that is uh, probably the quickest uh, four changes you'll ever see. What's good, peeps? It's your boy, Eduard Toda. Some people were suggesting um, some older magicians, some less known magicians, you know, not people on Full Last, not people on America's Got Talent. Uh, you know, these people, these kind of people, they definitely need some kind of exposure. I agree. Uh, some there's some really, really talent, good talent out there. Uh, so we're gonna be reacting to Bill Malone. Now, most people know who he is, but if you don't, this guy is probably, one, in my opinion, the most entertaining magician uh, that is actually has high, like he actually uses high level sleight of hand. I mean, I could watch this guy not do magic and I'll be entertained. But when he does magic and he's so good, uh, that just makes it even better. So Bill Malone's definitely a top, top dude. And um, let's check out his three card Monty routine now. Here's what we're going to start. We're going to have a good time, whether you like it or not. So uh, let's start. Would anyone like anything before we start? Potato chips, anything? We got everything outside. Here's what we're going to do. We're going to start off. Sir, if you're going to laugh, move around, make it look like a, make it look like a whole crowd of people in here, please. Thank you. I love now, his life. Now, we're going to start off with a little game, and this is a fun game. Bits. It's called Three Card Monty. Have you, any of you ever heard of Three Card Monty? Yeah. Oh, you have? Okay, but you're going to like this anyway, okay? Even if you know how it's done, it's a fun game, and we're going to let you, sir, David, it's completely different to we're going to let you, sir, method. be the spokesperson for the whole group. So everything depends on you. You're going to speak for everybody. Now, don't worry. If you lose the game, there's no prizes either way. So you really don't have to worry, win or lose, okay? And I'm going to go real slow. And when I'm done, I will teach everyone, even you, how the trick works. Okay, is that a deal? Okay, here we go. Now, remember, everyone can watch, but nobody helped David, okay? David, watch this close. We have here three cards, two black cards and a red card, okay? Can you see them? Right. Now, the red card is the money card. All you have to do, David, is keep your eye on the red card. If you pick it out, you're a winner. Okay? And good luck to you, David. I really want you to win. I do. Okay. <laughs> Watch close, David. There's a black one. There's a red one. And there's a black one. Now, what happens in New York City where they play the game a lot, what they do is they take the cards and they shuffle them real fast like this. And they talk to you while they do that. I'm not going to do that, David. <laughs> I'm going to go real slow just like this. Okay? Do you follow me so far? Okay. So let's start at the very beginning. Okay, here we go. Now, everybody remember, you can watch, but nobody helped David. He's on his own. David, can you see the red one? I can see the red one. Okay, I'm going to count to three. When I get to three, you yell, go, and I'll shuffle them. You ready? Okay, it's going to be fast. So as soon as you get to three, I'm going to start. So check this out. You ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Go. Watch the red one. I remember this. I remember this. Let me know if I'm going too fast here, David. <laughs> Now, David, that, that was just for practice. Just for practice. Which one would you say it is? For practice. This. Everybody picks that one, David. Everyone, but don't. That's a black one. You see? Thank you. I like that attitude, sir. All right. That's a black one. See, the red one is here in the middle. Now, hold on. No, no, no. I know. Sir, stop. I know what happened. I went too fast. I'm very sorry. <laughs> Let me slow it down. I forgot. I'm dealing with David. I'll slow it down just a little bit. We'll do it again. Watch close, David. Watch close. Now, watch me close. Keep your eye on the cards. Okay. Keep your eye on the red one. Pay no attention to the black. When you're ready, I'll mix them. You ready? Oh. <laughs> I think he caught me. Please, stop it, sir. Don't help him. I'm sorry. Where would you say it is? It's right. Everybody picks that one, David. But I'll tell you what. I'll give you a chance to change your mind if you want. No, it's right here. <laughs> okay, so David picked the middle one. I understand. Let's not break into a little discussion group, okay? Let's just settle down. <laughs> Everybody picks that one, David, but that's black. Oh, See, that's black. Hey, I only work here. All right. That one's black. <laughs> See, the red one is on the end. Now, how many of you would like to learn how it's done? Applaud if you'd like to learn. Okay, very good. Very good. See, it's, it's very easy. It's very easy when you think about it. See, David only has two eyes, and I'm using three cards. And that's pretty much the whole trick. I'm Bill Malone. Thank you. Good night, everybody. <laughs> No, 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 so I'll tell you what, David, let me make it easy on you. Okay? <laughs> if you just we'll eliminate off right one there. card completely, and I'll give you a 50-50 chance. We're going to play two-card Monty. This has never been done before in the history of the game. Good luck to you, David. I really I've never done it either, ever. Okay, watch close. Keep your eye on the red one. Watch close. Which hand? You guess. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry, David. See, these are the black ones. Oh. The red one we eliminated. Yes! I remember that kicker actually. Um, yeah, I've actually seen I've actually seen that before, but it's been so long that I figured um, 
I remember it being good, but I don't remember anything about. I didn't remember anything about the routine, um, so I figured you know it's been long enough where I can I can um, I can react to it basically. Uh, but man, he's got some funny lines in that. You know, he's always he's always working the crowd. He he kind of treats it like a comedy bit, but the cards are the subject if that makes sense. So like a comedian would talk about you know. Uh, I don't know, I was at school and this happened and that happened, uh, whereas Bill Malone, he kind of does that well with cards and his magic involved. It's really cool. I really like this guy's performances. Um, you know, it, it's it's really, really cool. I mean, when you think about it and, and you know, guys that, that do all this real big magic stuff that's set up and, you know, Chris Angel type dudes and... I mean, I'm not taking away any, you know, any taking away from any of these big magicians, Dynamo, uh, you know, um, David Blaine, all these dudes, like, you know, they, they do, you know, they definitely do good magic in the sense that people are drawn to it, and that's why they're famous, and, you know, they have good marketing, they have good, like, don't get me wrong, but when you, when you, when you actually see the amount of talent that, like, live talent and some of these dudes have that aren't really that well known, it's, it kind of makes you think, you know. Um, but yeah, that's a, that's a really, really cool three card Monty routine. I would never do it simply cause I like, you guys know, I like to just be able to carry a pack of cards with me around and do tricks, uh, you know, straight up. Um, but I have been thinking about incorporating the three card, original three card Monty scam, right? The real one into my two card Monty, which is, um, the original name of that is, uh, be honest, where is it by Eddie some, something, Eddie. Eddie Fetcher, that's the one. Uh, that's the original name of the Two Card Monty, but it, you know, it was popularized as the Two Card Monty, and then people started calling it that. Uh, but uh, I, I was thinking of putting the Three Card Monty, like the, the original scam, then teaching them how the scam works, and then doing the Two Card Monty, uh, you know, or the, the, the Be Honest Where Is It routine, and then transition into some other other trick. And I thought I think that would be really really cool because you kind of play a game at the start, and it's kind of magical, but it's not. And then you teach them, so they kind of the guards a little bit down and you're like look look we'll make it even even easier this time so you definitely follow it uh there's just two cards so where is and then boom they both change i think that could be really strong and i'm, I'm gonna be uh hopefully uploading some performance uh i don't know where i'm gonna do it but uh, i'll perform it to someone and then i'll upload it and uh, you guys will see i think it's a really strong kicker but anyway uh that'll be about it for this video if you enjoyed it leave a like subscribe uh you know i do daily videos so if you want to see more definitely click that subscribe button and the bell button if you want to get a notification when i post um, if you want to support me, on, I mean, follow me on all social media platforms, the links are down below. If you want to support me on Patreon, if you want to uh, come hang out on Discord, the links are down below. You know where to find them. I don't need to tell you at this point. You know where they are, you know what I'm saying? And as always, mad respect, much love, stay lit, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace!